Hello. I'm sorry, I don't quite understand. I'm Babino. I'm a scientist. Can I help? Ow! Babina was a brilliant scientist. But her discovery of a robot who'd been abandoned for nearly 100 years was about to change her life. Hmm. In fact, everyone's lives were about to change. I think the robot's trying to tell us something. So, there is something wrong. Something is heading towards Earth. Going to crash into Earth like an asteroid. But this isn't a real asteroid. It's like a Death Star, full of robots coming to invade. I think you hurt the robot's feelings. I believe you. But is there anything that could be done? Okay. Jenny needs help. For the next few days and weeks, Bibina and the robot could be seen going in and out of the cave, carrying all kinds of things. The people in the town thought Babina was a bit crazy, as she and her snake transported materials from her laboratory back to the desert. No one could figure out what they were doing. but they started to wish that they had listened to Jenny the robot when something that looked like an asteroid appeared in the sky. No one knew whether to believe the reports on social media that the asteroid was an invading robot army. And no one knew what to do until Bobina and Jenny emerged from the cave with a mega rocket. Are you sure this is going to work? Yes! By this point, Jenny the robot was starting to talk like a human. I have done my calculations, and if we launch right away, we can repel the invaders. But you can't go. I must. Then I must too. That's brilliant! Ah! Bobina survived. She was hailed a hero, but she would remain in a coma for a long time. Mm-hmm.
looked after by her brother and her pet snake. It was Jenny the robot who saved Babina. However, Jenny didn't survive the return to Earth and broke into a lot of pieces. Only Bobina would be able to rebuild the robot. So the townspeople built a statue to remember the robot hero who saved everyone. But who knows what else might be lurking in deep space.